hello and uh, welcome back it's been a few days since christmas uh, i just took a few days off um because 25 videos in a row is a lot and it is a lot of work so i just needed a few days off um just to rest but i didn't really rest because um uh, as you know we just moved and there was a lot of unpacking to be done so we are pretty much almost finished um i'm just in my office now it is the worst off room in the entire house i focused on all the other rooms first and uh now it's just my office is a bit of a mess um most of the boxes are unpacked but there are still three boxes in here that are full of my clothing um i'm just waiting for a hanger to get in they're supposed to be arriving sometime the next week so and then uh, i will get my office straightened out um but the rest of the house all the boxes are pretty much unpacked um some rooms are even like pretty much done she's like one or two more things to really complete them but for the overall for overall it's a uh, yeah, it's pretty much done. So today is December 30th, uh, tomorrow is New Year's Eve, and uh, we have booked a cottage with two of our couple friends, and we are going up north, I think to Bracebridge is where the cottage is, just to celebrate uh, New Year's. We're gonna be there four or five days, I think, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be a good time. But because of the coronavirus situation, we are all getting tested, so. We, me and Jason are going to a private lab. We have to pay to get the test, and then they give you the results really quickly because, they don't have to wait like the province has to wait for all the results to come back so you can get your own results very quickly and um yeah so we're just actually about to head out to do that now and then our friends are gonna go get theirs somewhere else and uh, if we all are clear um then yeah we're gonna enjoy the next four or five days all together in the cottage and if not then we're gonna have to figure out what to do because i don't think there's a refund on the cottage so that will, that's really gonna suck if uh one of us comes back positive but this will be my second test. I'm not looking forward to it. It was super uncomfortable last time. Um, so, really not looking forward to it. But, um, but I'm hoping we're all negative and this uh, goes ahead. We're just in the car now, headed to the place where we're going to get our tests. Are you excited? Yeah, I just wanna make sure I have the right place. Really not looking forward to it. It was super uncomfortable last time. But, um, safety no. first. It's different for a rapid, I don't know. They don't go up as Yeah, I heard that they don't go saliva, up, up as, ooh, that'd be lovely. We just had our first uh, rapid test. It was not nearly as bad as the PCR. They do not stick it up as far, but it is still uncomfortable a little bit, but definitely not as bad. I didn't even pull away this time, so it made me cheer up a little bit, but other than that, it was uh, just fine. So uh, we're gonna apparently get our results in a uh, half an hour. But anyways, uh, we're headed home now um, to await our results and also to get ready, packed up. Um, and then I will hit the road. So now uh, we got our results. They're both negative and uh, now it's time to go get packing and uh, ready to go.
so I am all packed up and ready to go. Just waiting for Jason. He's always, he's actually last minute, like five minutes before we leave, he's throwing a bunch of clothing into a suitcase, half of which he won't wear because it's not appropriate for a cottage. Um, but anyways, after I was done packing, I spent the rest of my afternoon just um, making older videos public that I had privated and also um, just uploading some of my very, very first videos from 2020. Like these are the first videos that I've ever made, ever filmed, edited. So uh, yeah, I just made those um, from Banff Public. Um, there's still ones from Niagara on the Lake, uh, Banff from 2021, and then uh, Mexico. As I've said before, this channel was supposed to be a travel channel. So I started out, my very first videos were travel videos. And uh, yeah, for about, um, yeah, for about a year and a little bit, I uh, every time we went on a vacation or away somewhere, I would, uh, make videos of it, uh, film it. So yeah, so I have all of Banff done, all of Niagara and the Lake done, and I'm starting Banff 2021. So um, I haven't uploaded uh, Niagara and the Lake yet, but um, I plan to do that next. It's the thumbnails that really get me. I, it's just, it's time consuming. I hate choosing the photo and the font and all of that. Like I just, it's not for me, um, but yeah. I've just made a bunch public, so uh, if you haven't seen them, go on over there and watch them and uh, laugh at me because these are literally the first videos I've ever made and uh, some of them are a little bit cringy, but. All right, it's about five o'clock and we're just about to hit the road. the cottage uh we can't figure out which one it is and our friends have already here they've already uh set up inside but then they went to the grocery store so uh they're apparently just two minutes away though so we're just waiting for them so they can show us exactly which one it is because it's a little confusing is this him all right it's probably him yeah is it okay hold on we're on the pursuit. Oh, here it is. Weird. All right, we have just arrived at the cottage and it is huge and beautiful. So we have the front walkway here. And then we have the nice and big kitchen. We have my friends here, Christina. Hi. Nice to meet you. <laughs> and Gabe <Hi>, there. <laughs> we have a whole laundry room, which is massive. I also have a huge, beautiful open living room. It's too big for me. There's just like two half of whatever up there. Oh, shit. Okay. And then down the hallway, we have this huge bathroom with a gorgeous tub there. We have two bedrooms. This is the room that our friends will be staying in. It's quite nice. A spare room just right in here. Finally, we have the master bedroom where me and Jason will be staying, which is huge and gorgeous. It has a walk-in closet. And then, best of all, we have our very own ensuite washroom. So, it is absolutely perfect for us. Um, the cottage that we stayed at in September was like half the size and half this nice. So I'm really happy about this choice. Um, 
yeah, so today is December 30th, so uh, tomorrow's New Year's Eve. Tonight, I believe we're just gonna order in Mexican and uh, just, yeah, get settled in and start enjoying this beautiful place. So it's about 8.20. Uh, Jason and Gabe have gone to go pick up our Mexican food. Uh, the restaurant closes at 8.30 because we are in a small town. So we ordered online and uh, apparently this is the place to, to eat in town. So I'm uh, kind of looking forward to that. Um, yeah, I just got a chicken and cheese quesadilla because I am super picky and I don't really like anything else. So um, yeah, so they should be back shortly. And then we'll uh, enjoy some dinner. I made one mistake. I didn't go. I turned for going straight. It was not a big deal. I realized. <laughs> okay. I realized within ten seconds I went the wrong. Yeah, that's true. That's true. It was easily correctable. The restaurant was packed. Was it actually? There were like seven people. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, there's seven people. Yeah. I told the Christina off. What? I was waiting for like a minute, and no one was there, and they were in the back, and I walked to the back and knocked on the door. God bless. <laughs> Gabe's becoming, Gabe's becoming a little Sophie Madero. No, no. <laughs> I was just joking. <laughs> no, you're counting about ten percent of you. <laughs> so I just got my quesadilla, and it doesn't just have cheese and chicken in here. Look at this. Look. What is this? What is that? There's onions in there. Call <laughs> it. So there's barely any cheese, and now I have to pick out all the little onions. I'm not happy. Adding some more cheese. How does everyone's food? Soggy. Oh. Well, after I took all the onions out of my quesadilla, it was actually okay, edible. I finished it, but I uh, would not recommend that restaurant. It's a local favorite though, so. No best best base for that offer apparently. <laughs> so we're just about to play trouble, which is like the most fun game that makes no sense. Like it's the most simple game. It makes no sense why it's so fun. It's completely up to chance. But it is actually just the funnest game ever. Okay, ready? You love me, remember that. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, Is God. everyone gonna get over me? All right, come on. Oh, sorry. <gasps> oh. Oh no, sorry. Oh no, sorry. <laughs> I I love you so much. Oh no, no, but you need no, to go no, back. No. <laughs> Six. Let's go. <laughs> this is chaos. This is pure chaos. At least you're not gonna knock three. Me. Five. Right. One, two, three, four, five, you're gone. <laughs> <laughs> <We're> gone. <laughs> casual how, how, how is it there chilling? <laughs> I like it. It's, very it's a warm house. <laughs> it is a nice fireplace. Let her live. Four plus audience. Oh, oh man, I thought it was a six for a second. No, it's a five. Oh, I got the six. I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Face. Oh, of course. Yeah, I don't you like that. Your to be honest, I rather not have sex there. No. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I I want to do it. I can't Wait, do it. Why? I can't you, do you, it. You have to do <laughs> it. Good. Oh, no. have to. I love her. <laughs> I have to do it in good faith. She's had some hard times. Do you like clapping like this? Or like this? <laughs> Are you a front or a side? I like this one. Well, I, I oh, sorry. I'm still. Oh shit, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I thought you were still home, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I, already, I, already, I already went. Mm -mm. See, oh, mm -mm. I, I, that doesn't count, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. Uh, so I, I, no. Oh. Yep, yep. I mean, you are winning. Don't yeah. <laughs> Why? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, do you want to go shake the cake? <laughs> I can shake the cake for you. Open this. All right. I like long this as like the mini shake the cakes. They're like this big. <laughs> They're, what, the Italian shop had them hanging from the ceiling. As Nobody you do. cares. <laughs> you shake the cake. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. 
it with a Yule log. It's usually like a log with like chocolate in the back. I never win. It's fine. I've accepted it. <laughs> I'm here to participate. So it's about 1.30, it's uh, a little past my bedtime, but we had a really fun night playing Trouble and then a Cards Against Humanity. Um, and now I'm going to get ready for bed, but I just wanted to unpack here in this giant closet first and just uh, really get settled in. So let's do that. for bed um i've just tried out a new toner and um i don't think it's agreeing with me um mm. having a little bit of a breakout but anyways it's way past my bedtime so i am going to sleep thank you so much for watching and uh we'll probably see you tomorrow for uh new year's eve so good night my office though is uh definitely needs Rambo wants in. Hey, buddy. Sorry. You want in? Come in. Come in. Okay. I'm sorry. I mean to lock you out. Anyways. <clears throat> I know. Now you want out, right? Now the door's closed. Okay. Anyway. Our results are in.